The official docs literally line carbon up as C++ to carbon. In the same way, we think about JavaScript to TypeScript or Java to Kotlin. It's not trying to be a fresh ecosystem. It's trying to sit on top of the C++ code. So what happened? Why did the hype wave crash so fast? Part of it is just expectations versus reality. The initial announcement cycle made it sound like near-term C++ replacement. But if you look at the actual roadmap, Carbon has always been a very long game. The current public plan is an experimental MVP 0.1, and that is not expected until late 2026, at the earliest. And then to get to production ready 1.0? Well, that's not even until after 2028. In other words, in 2025, Carbon is intentionally still in the research and design phase. Subscribe and watch the full video at the link below.